Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here and welcome to the final part of Monsters Inc. Scare Island. This is, uh, you know what, I've had a lot of fun with this Let's Play and you know what, I think so have so have you guys. And, uh, oh, I was, uh, I was trying to move my cursor out the way. And now I'm going to punish this, uh, wait, what? How do, I, how do I get this guy? Can I even get him? Wait, hold on. Okay, you know what, I'm going to ignore him. Um, and now I'm finally, we're finally ending this LP and oh my god, okay, I thought that was a, you see that? I thought it was a glitch. Okay, alright, what's going on here? I'm, I'm, I'm just going crazy here. Uh, I'm just skipping parts. You know what? We're going to do this on purpose. I'm going to get straight to the ski lift because it's really cool and get a bunch of box, uh, you know, like get a bunch of boxes and, and um, well, boxes really, um, primordial ooze and then we'll come back. So yeah, we've got a lot to do in this part. This will probably be the longest part, probably ne nearly an hour and it's 10.25 p.m. And uh, I've had a big day. It's Christmas. Uh, was it uh, Boxing Day here in Australia, which is the day you know you pack up all your boxes? Or I don't know, is that what is that why it's called Boxing? There, there is a reason it's called Boxing Day. I think the Brits call it Boxing Day as well. I feel. Um, anyway, how did I? Okay, at least give me at least give me a yes. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna ignore. Okay, okay I'm just gonna hopefully he will just get out of it. Now. Yeah, this is the final part. It's gonna be a long one, um, and I, you know, yeah, I've, I've had a big. I've had, it's been a big Christmas period. Um, I know on Christmas morning I put up a text jack, which is cool. Monsters Inc. is of course, uh, you know, it's not quite a text jack, but maybe, you know, what? maybe it's better. Maybe it's even better. All right, so we got this. Okay, this is awesome. Look at this. This is this is this bizarre thing that they added to the game. Like it feels so. Um, just randomly added, but like, I'm not against it at all. Okay, that was like super quick. Okay, would you like to retry it? Yes. Um, I'll go this way this time. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's like, you know, it's, it's cool they want to try a bunch of mechanics and stuff like that. Um, but it's it's kind of awkward, but... Uh oh, okay, we have to go again. You know what? I'll go again. Yeah, all right, okay. Yeah, so the first thing to note about this music, uh, sorry, but well, there you go, I've given it away. First thing to note about this level is that it has incredible music. The music is goated. All right, we're gonna go again. Yeah, the music is simply, it's simply the best. It's simply goated. Um, it's just a great track. Listen to this. There's no excuse to go as hard as it did. There you go. Listen to that, listen to this chords. And then repeats. That, that, it's, that, it's that little guitar, sort of like, and then it's like, you know, sort of like going down, you know, a couple, you know, semitones or whatever. It's just, yeah, it's just, it's, uh, it's brilliant. All right, anyway, would I like to retry it? Nope. And now we can head back here. What the freak? What the freak? But the guy with the Discord server uh, meme. All right, okay, here we go. Yeah, so what do, what do you guys all get? Let's let this final part, you know, it's, it's actually very apropos that, you know, for probably a majority of my viewers, you know, it is winter. Um, what did you what did you guys get up for Christmas or you don't celebrate Christmas uh, you know that kind of thing I mean you know I, I celebrate Christmas um, you know not not really for any like at this point it's like it's a family thing right that's basically what it is some people support it uh, some people do it for more of a religious reason um, which is obviously you know very much part of the part of the term but you know like I think a lot of Australian families um, you know it's very much like a you know just a you know just a, an excuse to give presents um, but yeah, it's, it's cool. Okay, that's hopefully I don't. I have a feeling I'm gonna get hit by something here. But oh, look at this front on view. This is very not normal. Oh look at that! Oh, he's, he's, he's like, that was like such a wrestling pose there. That wasn't. All right. Anyway, so a big chunk of the level is like okay, uh, so we've got the yeah, done that, done that through here. Okay, it's actually, so it's interesting, there's like three full sections in this level. Alright, so we're gonna go hop on one of these, hop on the ski lift. That's what it's called, the, it's called the ski lift because it's a ski lift and I fell. Alright. Is there a, is there a, yeah, there's a Monsters Inc. coin here, good. Token. A token Monsters Inc. coin. Okay. There you go. Hey, it's cool, you can actually see the other bit through there, but then it's like, it's like a, it's a, it requires a separate loading. Which is, I don't know, I find that interesting. Okay, uh oh. Okay, I'm just gonna be honest there, that was absolutely not my fault. That got stuck. I'm wasting my precious time. Okay, go up again. Alright. I don't like it. The camera's kind of I don't know, it's a little bit just a little bit a little bit Okay. 
This is actually awkward. Why would you have the side be there? Because you've got to jump past it? Okay, hold up. I'm gonna go like this. Okay, yeah, that's, that was kind of awkward, to be honest. I don't know, was it the same in the original version? I don't know, it doesn't, doesn't seem like it to me, but maybe I'm just going crazy. In the words of Matchbox 20, I'm not crazy, I'm just a little unwell. I know right now you know something. How I used to be. Okay. Matchbox 20. Me and my brother loved Matchbox 20, but not just Matchbox, Matchbox 20, uh, but um, uh, what's his name? Like Rob Thomas, I'm not talking about the creator of. Uh, uh, oh, damn it. I'm not talking about the creator of, um, what's it called, Veronica Mars, but, uh, you know, the, the lead singer of, of, yeah, of that, uh, yeah, Matchbox 20. Alright, anyway, so we're gonna get this one down here. Get another, oh, there's a, look, there's a Blue Nerve. A, a patented Blue Nerve this late in the level. That's actually kind of bizarre. But yeah, textures here, very, very low quality. Like, if we're talking about, like, the ability for this level to look... Um, like really, really good. Um, I it, again, it's oh, I love that guy. It's it, it's okay. I think some of the textures look pretty cool. Other parts kind of look mid. Like it, I don't know. It, again, and then that's, that's the story of this game, isn't it? That is the story of this game. I mean, all right. Let's 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 see if we can. We'll just get the red. We'll get enough to get red. Get left. We'll get get enough to get left on red. All right. Alright, here we go. Let's see if we could actually... Will we be able to get enough to get red? Let's see. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. Could be... Could be a bit of a problem. Alright, well, anyway, I'm going to see if I can... Let's see if I can cross over. Can I do it? Can I do a jump? Oh, you're kidding. You're actually kidding. Alright, can, can we... Now, can we just go up to the top here and just skip it? That'd be awesome. Can we do it? We can't. I messed up. See if I can. Okay, hold on, hold on. This this could be. I feel like I feel like if I could. Yes, you're kidding. Oh my god. That was. You know what? Full credit to myself there. I'm I'm gonna be completely arrogant about that and say that that was the most uh, incredible speed running strat I've ever seen in my life. Is this another blue nerve? You're joking. You're kidding. All right, here we go. Well, anyway, that's good. So we've got that. There we go, done. And now I'm gonna hard cut to the loading screen for the final level. Well, before the before the last boss. Well, it's not even a boss, isn't it? Jeez. All right, here we are, loading up hot springs. Not for some reason this one doesn't have the hot springs in it. What's with that? We got the Monsters Inc. logo on the background there. All right, so this is another cool music, high octane music. You know fun, energetic um, music. I've been listening to a lot of that lately. Have anyone heard of the genre, or sub-genre, whatever, plug and B? Like P-L-U-G-G-N-B. It's like a derivative from plug. It's like really, I was like, I've been talking about it with like anyone that listened. Me and, actually, shout out to Unlisted Leaf. Me and him were talking, I was showing him some, some plug and B, like sort of plug and B house kind of stuff. It's fantastic music. Um, it's like really kind of like, synthy, simple drums, and it's sort of got a little bit more complicated, but you know, like, it's, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but it's just like really cool. I found this artist that uses a lot of like, well, it's like a famous plug and B artist that uses a lot of like that kind of influence called um, Little Hero, Little Hero, and it, uh, she does some great music, but it's produced by um, this other guy who is fantastic, like he does all the beats, but anyway, Monsters Inc. All right, let's, yeah, so this is the last level. To be honest, to be honest, this just looks like the, the, this pretty much looks exactly like the original last level. Maybe just slightly upscaled. Even the lighting is, yeah, it's, it is what it is. And there's sort of a few little, little frame drops I'm noticing. The thing, this level takes a yard awful amount of time to beat, actually. It's like, it's, it's, it's just a long level. Um, and I actually don't want to come back to it. I actually don't want to backtrack to it. So I'm actually going to end the LP. We're gonna end it here. Um, yeah, no, I'm kidding, but I should. I should actually just do that. I mean, you know, God, I still need to finish off so many LPs. Like, you want to? Okay, I want. I want this to have amazing. And not just because I mean that would just be great all the time, but I want this part to have like amazing engagement. I want not only to talk about Christmas. I want to talk about LPs that I haven't finished. No, oh, damn it, let's jump right into that. 
I want to talk about the fact that I haven't finished Daxter yet. The fact that I haven't finished D, uh, not Dio, Jinx. The fact that I haven't finished Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4 because I lost the file. Um, Crash 4, it's about time. I'm never going to beat that one. It's too long. Crash 3, you know, I'm just, uh, I'm messing up. I'm, I'm a big disappointment right now with some of those old LPs. So I'm actually glad to get one, start one here and get one done. Um, all right, let's uh, go across. There we go. Oh, okay. Oh, you know what? All right, all right, all right. In the words of that, uh, oh, in the words of that guy that says, "All right, all right, all right," Matthew McConaughey. He's known for it now. Um, that actually looked really good. That actually looked really good. That had like a had an energy to it, uh, a PS2 energy to it. You know what I'm saying? All right. Anyway, so let's see what we've got here. It's gonna boost this up. No, it's not. Wait, is it? Did that, is it doing anything? Let me go. Okay, now imagine, imagine if I could utilize my magic and get that to work with that. Now I feel like, okay, so pretty much we've reached the end of where I can actually go in that area. Oh, here we go. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna have to come back. We're gonna have to need the, the slingshot ability. Yeah, see, so look at some of the textures there. So, like, this, like, clearly they're, like, slightly better than PS1, but, yeah, we've, we've sort of re- we're, I've, I've talked about that before. All right, so let's, let's go through here and see if, see if this is the right way to go. It, I don't know, I, I never got good at this area. Um, I remember, like, you know, in speedruns and stuff, I remember not, you know, I remember getting lost and stuff like that. Okay, so we're coming back through this way. All right, let's see. Let's see. Oh, what was that? You see that? All right, let's get the- hopefully there's enough. One, two, three. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. how good. That is the most satisfying thing. But yeah, okay, so lots of comments. Christmas, me not finishing LPs. How about we talk about the fact that, uh, yeah, let's talk, let's re revisit, revisit the whole Ape Escape thing, right? What would be some other elements you would have added to that from Ape Escape? Like, would you have had potentially, like, gadgets? Do you know what game is similar to that? There's the, and I want to do an LP of this, the Jimmy Neutron Attack of the Twonkies. That has those gadgets, sort of has like a gadget based system, Gadgetron. And, uh, and that was pretty cool, right? You know, like I think that that actually, that actually was, that was decent. Um, yeah, what do, what do you guys think? I don't know, I feel like, I feel like maybe, maybe something like that, Attack of the Twonkies. Um, yeah, but yeah, when you go through here, it's all pretty samey. It's interesting, it's like one, it's like just one, one kind of big corridor, like some of the other levels were, well, I wouldn't say, maybe I wouldn't use, maybe creative is too nice of a term, but yeah, like there's that element of like, there is that element of like basicness to this. Although you know, I guess I guess they're kind of going for yeah. You know, they've got all these springs and pools and puddles and, and stuff like that. So I mean, there's some stuff. Some stuff's cool. All right, is this gonna be it or one more? Either way, I'm gonna have to get out of here because like yeah, I'll go all the way back to the. Uh, oh, I wonder where they where they're gonna. Where's the hidden one? I don't even know. All right, anyway, they go done, done, excellent, yeah. All right, frame skip. Well, okay, hold up. Maybe I'll just, ugh. you know, what I'm gonna do. Watch this, watch this. I'm gonna play it. In, I'm gonna play it in fast mode. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some, uh, some music over this. I'm gonna put some of my own music over this, just to skip through. All right. Right now, you're hearing my own music. Hashtag cheap plug. Look, this is how the game. It may, you know, the game probably could run slightly faster. To be perfectly honest. Um, yeah, anyway, there goes that one, that one, and then go up, go through here. This is true on crack, uh, let's play. Wait, have we already done this before? I thought we've already been here. Yeah, see, look, useless. See, this is why it's actually good to play like this. Oh, we get this one. Look at this. This is the new way of playing the game. I was actually, you know what, yeah, I, I confession to make, I actually lost my save of like the game, like one like part. So I had to like play the last part again and I actually played it at this speed. Anyway, there we go, done. All right, so anyway, time to quick scare island and we are going to get one last cutscene. <gasps> oh no. Ugh, I want to see it. Ah, you've done it again, boys. I'm very pr proud. You'll now be able to use the fling shots. Good luck.
hell yeah. You, you hear that like frame skipping? It's like yeah. All these amazing scenes in the movie. Are you excited for you know? I watched the first couple episodes of Monsters at Work, but here got spoilers here. Spoilers right now for the next like thirty seconds. The way that the series ends, right? It ends with like basically being a um, you're gonna uh, you know we're gonna like like you know you're gonna get boo. So it means that season two will actually take place after you know the movie. Finally, that's what I want to see. So I kind of want to have to go back and watch this through. Now, to me, this doesn't look anything like unless I'm just completely misremembering. It doesn't really look anything like it. Like, is it the same skybox, maybe? I don't know, I, I might have to have a look at that, but yeah, it, it definitely feels different. Again, these levels all look darker, um, which is, I don't know if that was like the intent. Um, okay, come on, come on, come on. You know, I just find it, I, I just find this funny, right? And obviously it's, I love the PCSX2, you know, developers and everything like that. They're very hard workers, but there is something a little bit funny about how the fact that this has like more like breaks in it and like like glitches and, and sound glitches and stuff and like frame skips than Rouge, uh, you know, like the, the actual Switch emulator. Um, like that's just, that's just insane. I mean, obviously it's, your mileage may vary, you know, depending on what one it is, but all right. Okay, so I was gonna say getting, oh, yeah. Okay, here's, here's one thing, right? Why would anyone bother getting lives at this point in the game? You've just gotten basically to the end of the game. Okay. Get them. Oh, I need to get all these. Okay, they really, they really did spam them here just to make sure you got it right. And that's it. LP hey, over. You won't be so lucky next time. Nope, I don't even want to save. No. No, Sully. We are here today to congratulate James P. Sullivan and Michael Wazowski for their on-target completion of level one. Up the academy. Congratulations, boys. I'm honored to present you both with these bronze medals to commemorate your achievement. Congratulations to you both. Well, look, bronze medal, credits. Are we gonna get the credits? No. Wait, do we get the, get, do we not get the credits or you gotta just act? No, I'm trying to think. I don't know why that sounded American there, like, no. Alright, anyway, back into the Sugar Shack, and let's play as Mike. We, you know, Sully got a lot of time uh, in these, this last part, you know, and I think that's fair, because, you know, Mike was, Mike Wazowski was used to cheat, you know, all throughout the map. Um, now it's time for, uh, you know, yeah, get a bit of Sully time, and now back to Mike again. Alright, Michael Wazowski. Okay, anyway, so time to use this slingshot. I didn't even talk about the ability there. But yeah, that was, a, that was a fun last little challenge there. Now, I think I already got this one last time, but this is proof. Yeah, so this is this this to me is the strangest level in the whole game. It's just how, like, dark it got for no reason. Or what it feels like no reason. Anyway, let's hit that. There we go, boom. Oh, I think I got that one as well last time, but ah well. And... No! What am I missing? Hold up, let's go up here. Maybe up here. Oh, what do I do? Yeah, this this is a it's a pointless. It, you know, like it, it's just you know at least uh, the reason why I like the um, the trampoline is because you can cheese it. It's a lot harder to cheese um, the slingshot targets. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm trying. To Is that like not part of it? Hmm. Okay, one over there. Okay. There we go. That was weird. There we go. There's, There's the this. Monster. There's a monster. Not bad for a guy with one eye. Okay. No. Thank you. Perfect. Yeah, what's with the skybox too? Look at the misery there. It's almost like something out of the PS, you know, Monsters Inc. PS2 game. Nah, it's not even that. Alright, do you guys want me to do Monsters Inc. PS2? Like, a retrospective of that? I think I could do that maybe in, you know, it was 15 pass was the first time back in 2012, I think it was. It was so laggy, so glitchy nowadays on PCSX2, it should play a million times better. But I reckon it would also be kind of cool because, um, I'd be able to, um, 
yeah, you know, get to get more parts done in more things and probably collect more as well because I know I missed a bunch of stuff the first time. Um, anyway, so where's the... Oh, he's over there. Oh, you see that rail thing? I, you know, I never really use the railing there. Don't have to. Okay. Oh, go on. Alright, uh, what am I doing? What is going on? There you go. No, you're kidding. Oh, wow, okay, he did a bit of it. He actually did a bit of an ape escape here. This is a bit of an ape escape right here, running away. Wow. Love to see it. You know what? What's with that? They just added that mechanic. That's a mechanic that just didn't exist, like, at all in, like, any other part of the game, as far as I remember. So, I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad they expanded their horizons a little bit. The Horizon Zero Dawn. Alright, and done. Thank you very much. Gold medal is mine. Again, not bad. One eye, four eye. Alright, first things first is to just go over to this slingshot right here. And where does it take me to? What the hell does it do? Oh, that's where the that's where it's meant to be, isn't it? Um, hold up, what am I looking for here? I'm looking for something else, aren't we? Where is it? Is it is it the monster thing? Oh yeah, over here. Yeah, okay, cool. There you go. Okay, that's that one. And then did I? I think I might have missed that one that time. And that's it. Who's the monster? Me. I'm just listening to the music. That's what we're doing. This is a listen to the music part. And there it is, of course it is. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, so our seventh one should be a seventh. Was it, what did they say? Was that religious thing? That's Avenge Sevenfold? No. Seventh Day Evangelist or something as well? Anyway, jump back. And then we've done this one. This was, this was an easy backtrack. Actually, the first two are pretty easy. The next one is uh, oh yeah, it's pretty easy too. It's just, it's the hot springs one that's an absolute pain in the gat. Oh my god, jeez, I can't believe I just said that. Oh, I've just like de-aged, like, well, you know what, maybe it's a, it's a de-aging thing. I've de-aged like 14 years. I saw my cousin now. Sticking out your gat for the Rizla. Alright, anyway. So this is, people are going to come across this in 10 years and go, what the absolute, like, hell is going on? Okie dokie, so we are here in the ski lift again, and I think it was, what was it, just over, over here somewhere. Okay, hit that, make sure we don't get in trouble. Alright, that's pretty, again, oh, oh, that was scary. Pretty simple stuff, look, oh, look at that nice, nice blue sky there. Ah, very nice. Blue sky, sky blue. AEW yeah, wrestler. Alright. There we go, one more, and there, and then done. Yeah, so these these are pretty, it's pretty simple backtracking, isn't it? See, the Sphinx had a good backtracking element because it had that whole thing with the, you know, the extra section, like the whole extra section. That kind of worked. Anyway, good. Want to save now? Nope. And links right back to the start of the level. Wow. Yeah, look, look at the, look at the skybox there. It's like it, it's it's a strange one. It's like really nice and blue there, and then it almost looked like it like had like a repeated texture at the bottom. Anyway, oh, get stuck. What is going on? All these lo look at these loadings. Bizarre. What's in here? Wait, what, what the hell's in here? Oh, it takes you to the top. Oh, you must break over the. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Catch you back to the start. Well, we never really had to use it, didn't we? Anyway, that's fine. Understandable. Well, we didn't have to. We, you know, we just did it. We went three runs through. Could have probably got it in two, but I failed. I failed hard. Actually, it wasn't that bad. And there we go. That's our gold. Anyway, oh, are we gonna get a? I think we're gonna get a silver medal. F no, no, we're not gonna get that. Okay. Well, actually, we'll get it in the next part. So, well, not in the next part, but make it a bit. Anyway, see you in uh, the hot springs. All righty. So here we are in the hot springs and. We've still got a lot to do, don't we? Okay, we're gonna go come down here. Okay, I never would have. That was fluke if I knew about that. Um, let's see, where is this? This is. I don't even know where we are at this point. Um, okay, so we've gone that way. Is this back to the start of the level? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, alright. 
I feel like I'm going to be here for a long, long, long time. Okay, I've got that. Okay, I feel like, yeah, I don't know. I just feel like I'm going to be here for a long time. So let's maybe take the... F Did we already do this? No, so that's the start. All right, where we go? There. Nothing else there. We need to get a bunch more Monsters, Inc. tokens. Which might be easier said than done. There's like three more. Anyway, we'll try it. We'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do. We'll go up here. But yeah, I can't believe this is over. I can't... It's been a quick... It's been a quick time, but it's been a fun time. Is this what I already did? Okay, hold up. Let me just... This is the thing. It's like a left or right thing, and I just don't have any faith in anything that I'm doing. Alright. It's, it's just one of those levels, you know what I mean? It's just one of those, those levels. Alright, is this what we just did? No? Okay, I think this is new. This is new. We need, do we need to get to that end bit again? Right, and then all right, over here. Uh, this is going to be activated. Oh, I didn't remember this. Did I just not get this the first time? Okay. There you go. All right, that's that one. Okay. Nothing else here. Okay, cool. All right, good. This is good because I, I actually didn't know that that's what I'm doing. Okay, so we got there. Okay, through here now. This is a good way. We are, we are making our way. I really do like these crystals here. That is crystal. This is almost a crystal fissure, isn't it? Like Kingdom Hearts 2. Shout out Crystal Fissure. It's a great level name. Don't know why anyone would want to use it for a, a username, but you know, here we are. All right, now what's this going to actually do? We didn't actually do that last time. Oh. Oh, just... Oh, probably should have... Probably should have selected that from day one, actually. That's my own fault there. They probably would have... Yeah, that lets you skip way further up, doesn't it? All right. Anyway, we've got to go across here. Uh-oh. No. Wow. Jeez. It's a bit, bit of a, it's a bit of a rough jump there. Bit of a rough jump. Alright, here we go. Love this bit. Uh-oh. That almost that almost that almost ended it for me. Alright, well we've almost made it. It's over here, isn't it, where the slingshot is? Yes! We did it. We made it! Alright, up here, and there we go, that's 9, I think. Please be 10 in here, please be 10. Oh. Oh, look at this, that's cool. What's with that? Oh, I like this, I forgot about this. Very nice. See if this will drop on our head. No, it didn't. Alright, and there we go, let's press that one. Oh my, okay. So now it takes you all the way up in case you fall. How good is that? Alright, this should be it now. Yes. There's 10 up there. Look at that. We can see out, out of a thing. That's kind of surreal, isn't it? Oh, look. Oh, oh, what was... You see that? That's strange. Oh, we're going to get the cutscene. Don't tell me I've soft-locked it. Oh, thank goodness. We are here today to once again congratulate James P. Sullivan and Michael Wazowski for their impressive completion of level two of the Academy. Of the Academy. Years of Academy training wasted. I am honored to present you both with these silver medals to commemorate your achievement. Congratulations to you. Oh god, look at that smile. Anyway, that's that done. And now just one more thing to go. Oh, you get a new cutscene. Nice. No, not cutscene, movie scene. Alright. Skip that. And... No, oh no, 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 you gotta come back. Okay, that's why they do that. That's actually why they do that. That's infuriating, but also... There you go, we're ending with, we're ending with Sully now. Hey, hey, I'm the monster. Hey, hey, I'm the last player. Um, yeah, okay. That's, that's, that's actually annoying. You know what I mean? Like, it's... <laughs> but I get it. They, they want to give you a silver medal. But who cares about the silver medal? Right, who gives... Oh, God, where do I, where actually do I actually have to go? Where is this even? Where is this? I don't even know. How many cuts are in this part? All right, it's not this one, I don't think. Yes. Yeah, well, yeah, it's nothing. All right, well, it's gonna be somewhere. So there's the hidden one right there, and look, it's right up there. The question is, does it does it actually does it is it like already loaded or no? It is exiting the level, just have to make you reset it. Well, we're about to find out. 
Look, there's three extra lives up there, by the way, because this game just truly is so remorseless with their lives. Hashtag sarcasm, all right. Um, okay, so we're there. Yes, as far as I'm concerned, it does not look like it's reset it, so we're gonna have to run through one more time, but that's okay. Get that life there. No, nope. how did I miss that again? Because you don't want to jump too early, because then you'll end up falling through. Alright. Oh, oh, what the fucking... What the absolute hell was that? No, not the start of the level again. You're actually taking the piss. Alright, we're back. For the last time. This is the last time I've ever, I'm ever cutting away. This LP. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna, what we're gonna do after this. Like, LP-wise, because I've got so many, as I said, I've got so many other ones on. But, um, I'm I really enjoy Mario Kart. I really hope that you guys, um, I'm gonna do this just in case I, I fall. Yeah, I really enjoy Mario Kart. I know it's not super popular, like, Nintendo stuff isn't super popular on this channel. But, uh, I do hope to be able to do more of that. Anyway, that's that one. I should have just got this. This is actually my own stupidity. I should have got that one before getting the Monsters, Inc. token. Like, that's actually, it's completely my fault. Like, I just added, I elongated this LP. Maybe it's because I don't want to say goodbye. You know, it's like uh, calling by your name. It's like I don't want to. I don't want you to leave. Actually, I watched that recently. Calling by your name. She's. That is one. I'm just gonna say it's one horny movie. Jesus. Christ. It's it's good. It's good though. It's a good movie. Shit. It uh, is a rare thing when a monster truly exceeds the expectations of the Academy. Today I present to you James P. Sullivan and Michael Wazowski. Together, they have accomplished what few before them have. Completion of the Academy, Level 3 training. The medals, please. These golden medals symbolize the highest level of accomplishment here at the Academy. Henceforth, you will be known as Top Scare Team and will be entitled to all the rights and privileges thereof. Congratulations to you both. All right! Whoa! Ow! It doesn't have to be this way. I have no. no choice. I'll condemn a thousand children before I let this company die. Oh, here's the credit, credit, uh, the credits. Credible? Credit. I don't know. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going crazy here. RV Winkler. So you get the credits once you do 100% completion, basically. So look at this team. Look, it's a good little team. And uh, look, my ultimate... Um, my ultimate thoughts in this game are this... Really, they, have they evolved since 2010? Maybe a little bit. I guess I would love to see what I said in 2014 and in 2020 slash 2021. Look, the PS2 version, I, I honestly think I probably still would vote the PS1 game over the PS2, I even after all of this. Just something about it. Uh, well, first it's easy to glitch, so I prefer that. But I don't know, something about it just works better um, for me, for like what they were trying to do. Like, it's like, it's like, this. it's a PS2 game that barely looks like a PS2 game, and it's a late stage PS1 game that like, didn't look amazing, but it did, it was passable for the PS1. You know what I mean? So Pierre-Luc Yoda, Yoda. So this is a very much a, a French team, French Canadian. Yeah, I would assume. I think are they? I'm pretty. Wait, let's have a look. Let me just double check that. Let me just look that up just in case. Artificial mind and movement. Oh wait, I said I typed in artificial mind and movie. I'm googling this right now on my phone. Dedicated uh, behavior interactive. Yeah. Okay. Quebec. Quebec City. Okay, that's, that's not, I cannot do French Canadian accent, I, I can't even, it's actually embarrassing even attempting it. But yeah, we're here, and we're done. We're done with Monster Zing, and this is, look, let's be honest, with, with Scare Island, this is probably the last time. So, pour one out, please like the video, please subscribe if you haven't, please comment on it, um, because this is probably the last time I'm ever going to be doing this, apart from maybe a live stream, you know? Here we go, there's uh, T. So Sohet and P. Roger for Arrogant Music. Okay, I'm gonna look up more Arrogant Music stuff because uh, someone did mention that in part one, I think it was. And you got Randy Newman as well getting credits here for, uh, you know, Walt Disney's, uh, you know, what the Monsters, the actual movie. But yeah, um, 
It's fantastic. It's uh, it's uh, the music is the music is probably the strongest element of the whole game, and I really do mean that. So I leave this game thinking, okay, I had fun. Uh, I also got frustrated. I wish it was more like Ape Escape. I'm going to say this now. I wish it was more like Attack of the Twonkies. Well, voice talents of all these guys: Carlos Alazaki, original voice of Spyro. Yeah. So it's like that's kind of what I wish we had a little bit, like you know, just that little bit more of it expanded experience maybe you know it'd be cool if the ps2 version could have actually done that like it would have been cool if it was actually a more of a genuine difference between it like they got more time to develop it or something flora collingwood collingwood football club is uh my one of my least favorite football clubs in uh, australia ever actually I, I if you're a collingwood fan well look i'll forgive you um but yeah the music's right out all right let's, let's skip it let's skip through then go a bit faster unfortunately these guys aren't getting us enough credit uh, in comparison Developed by artificial weight. Hold up, it's not repeating, is it? Is it? I think it did. I think it's just repeated. That's interesting. All right, well, anyway, check in the memory card. What happens here now? Is this, please tell me it actually saved. Oh, wait, hold on, I actually didn't save. So look at this. Yeah, 877. See, what the? You see that? That's it. Wait a minute, so how about, oh my goodness, okay, so you should have saved at the end there. If you don't save, you've just basically just lost the progress, right? Well, anyway, thank you all for watching. Thank you for watching this LP. Never LPing it again. This is the final time, but I had fun. Thank you all. I really appreciate it. The words of my, my idol, Kenny Omega. Goodbye, mwah, and good night, bang.